Uh, I'm not sure I understand why this superstar is doing this, but we need some extra help out here. Yeah, it doesn't matter here why. security. Just get the guy off him. He has lost his mind. They knew what they were doing. I don't even think this opponent can get into this match. Not at all. I mean, this competitor just got ambushed. This isn't right. The tensions between these competitors almost completely disrupted this match. But now these superstars look ready for even more action. And you know what? I respect the decision to still go through with this match after an attack like that. I'm not sure whether I think they're brave or foolish, but it does take guts. Oh, not pretty. Drop. He moves just in time. Choke slam. Oh, kick right to the back. Wards off that offense from Hall. Uh oh, captured. Oh, face buster by the game. Can he do it here? Kicks out on the pinfall attempt. It'll take more than that to hold him down. They're lining up their opponent. What do they have in mind? Oh, knee drop. Woo! <laughs> to the outside. This could get wild. What are the keys to victory for an athlete like Scott Hall in this matchup? You don't make it through what Hall has without a tremendous amount of toughness. But the thing that makes Hall so dangerous is his in-ring IQ. Once he identifies a weak point, he should exploit it any way he can. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Stomping their opponent. Followed by a forearm smash. Whip back into the ring. Smart strategy, attack the knee. Scott is in command right now. Hall with solid in-ring smarts as he exploits his opponent's weaknesses. Wicked clothesline. Good timing with that reversal. Into the hammerlock. Oh boy, back suplex. Into the cover. And he manages to kick out in one. This isn't even close to over. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right to the face. My God. Oh, knee drop. Woo. Oh, he got him. Is he going to look? And the rope forces the break. Great effort, though. First, I think the ring just shifted. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Underhanded face rake throws off the attack. Choke slam by Scott Hall. He can end it here. Frustration might be starting to set in. Scott Hall has got a right where he wants him. Up and outside of edge. Hall put a stamp on this one. On a kick out, kick out of two. Unbelievable resilience and resolve from Triple H. The game is still in this. Guys, Hall can't believe it. That move has finished off so many. Competitors. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. And some effective offense with that one. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. He's one step ahead there. He's burying elbows in the midsection. 
And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Hall is just adding insult to injury here. Wow. Just rubbing salt in the wound now. He is mentally and physically exhausted now. He needs to get himself some room to regroup fast. Drop that bow. The game in bad shape right now. Hall cannot be stopped right now. A death lock is in. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Are we going to see a tap? In full control of their opponent with more in mind. Disc is punch. Oh, what incredible power. Wow, what a vertical suplex. Wicked clothesline. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, look at this aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. Caught the leg. Clothesline takes him down. Forget about it. Veteran instincts from Triple H. Whatever you can do, I can do better. Counters on top of counters. Delivering nasty stops. You have to think these competitors expected this. Here we go. Down with the elbow. Triple H is reeling. Might be game over. Scott Hall setting his opponent up. The game is one step ahead. Ooh, cheap shot right above the eye. And Hall has been taking hits after hits in this one. Yeah, it has seemed like one major obstacle after another for Hall. Both arms hooked. Pedigree applied. Good night. This is troublesome for Scott. Shoulder tackle. A spine buster. Back crushing. Arms hooked by the game with a pedigree. Triple H has this all sewn up. stage some trash talking underway are you really that surprised these two can't stand one another looks like this superstar is more than willing to oblige oh here we go this might blow up before our very eyes oh these two are gonna go at it on the stage oh here we go Shots exchanged, and now we got officials out here trying to break it up. Trying to maintain some sort of order. Good luck with that. So much disdain between these two men. Perhaps the most dangerous face of Foley. Cactus Jack, an individual always dreaming up innovative ways to put himself in harm's way. I am honestly scared to think about what goes on in the mind of Cactus Jack. 
Lock up against Eddie Guerrero. Defend against Guerrero. Family values or uh, well, lack thereof. Right, we are in for a treat tonight. Former ECW star who has had unmatched success in WCW. Former WCW Cruiserweight and United States Champion, a man who has held the ECW television title. And above all, Eddie Guerrero doesn't care if he's liked. Eddie Guerrero always sporting that cocky look on his face, but to Guerrero's credit, he always backs it up inside the ring. He may be a cruiserweight, but he can take on anyone. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WCW. Hardcore Championship! Introducing the challenger from Truth or Consequences, New Mexico. Weighing in at 287 pounds, Cactus Jack! And his opponent from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 228 pounds. WCW Hardcore Champion, Eddie Guerrero! Intensity on the face of the champion, challenger in the corner, looking more determined than I've ever seen. Oh boy, guys, I don't know what to expect in this match. Cactus Jack is known as one of the most volatile superstars in WWE history. Volatile, Cole. Cactus Jack is unquestionably out of his damn mind. He has to be the most feared of Mick Foley's fractured psyche. No argument from me there, Corey. We'll have to see how long this lasts before things get extreme. He better be ready because standing across from him is an amped up Latino heat. There are a few competitors who can hang with Eddie Guerrero. I have to agree with you, Corey. Trying to keep up with Eddie or attempting to go move for move with him is highly ill-advised. Oh, working on the arm. Uh-oh, look at what are they going to do? Oh, right to the face. Right to the back of the neck. And again. Enough. Relax, handle. Oof. You can't get caught in a hailstorm like that if you want to win. Jack perched up top. Oh, look out. Power slam puts a quick stop to the offense. Kick to the midsection. Could be thinking about the gory special. Yes, that's exactly what they were trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drag. Beautiful escape. Oh, man. The champ trying to roll with these hits. And for a guy like Cactus Jack, who just keeps coming back, how do you manage to keep him down? Just keep attacking again and again. It might not take one big move. It might take 10. Just keep going and don't stop until he isn't moving. And then hit him again just to make sure. Ah, look at 
at this. Oh, putting focus on the arm here. The referee continues. The count may call it soon. He's burying elbows in the midsection. We could have been looking at a count out there. Yeah, you just know that would have been a deflating result for the WWE Universe. to see the tolls of this match add up. Going for a pin for the championship. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. A little closer to getting the pinfall there, but this is still anybody's fight. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. Oh, And now thrown back into the ring. Close line! Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Eddie gets countered. Compromised position here. Oh, right to the throat. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, look at his aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. The champ looking worn out. Cactus trying to make this match as grueling as possible. Oh. Able to get the advantage here. Great reversal. The challenger pin. Is this it? Great officiating as the ref noticed he was on the ropes. With an uppercut. Covered by the champ. Emphatic kick out for the challenger. Strong kick out, but you have to wonder if he can keep it up. Able to parry that one. His athleticism is off the charts. He hits the head scissors. On. Another lance. Looking for a little bit of high risk here, it seems. Look at the high oh, side of the flag. Another one bites the dust to the chain. Kick out. Still has hope. I don't believe it. How did the challengers survive that? by the skin of their teeth. And don't expect the champ to start going easy on them now. And we know Eddie must be feeling desperate right now, unsure of how much more he needs to do. The athleticism, control, and power Eddie Guerrero possesses in that one maneuver. Look at the high nobody home. A foot just stomping down. Eddie is in a haze. Big trouble might be coming for him. Back to Jack, delivers the butterfly DDT. The title might change hands. Two count, amazing. I knew it would take more than that to put the champ away. But just how much more is needed? The end could still be right around the corner. Hey, it might be time for a change of strategy. His best move didn't get the job done. It has been a constant barrage from each of these competitors. Almost a hazardous amount of punishment has been dealt. It's got to be concerning. Clearly, neither man is worried about their well-being. Cactus Jack has it locked in. The man of the pro. The king of the death match living up to his name. I told you this guy's a maniac. He let him wrestle here tonight. Cactus Jack has him hooked. Cactus Driver. We can have a new champion. Who wants it more? Perched up top, through the air, and connects! 
You want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. A non-stop assault from Jack here. Absolutely. Jack is breaking his opponent down. And that definitely made solid impact. Listen to this crowd. What a feeling. And these superstars are feeling it too. Seated drop kick. Drop kick right on point. Trying their opponent's arm out. There's a double stop right down the arm. And he gets set back into the ring. He's headed up top. Thinking big. From the heavens, big time splash. An unrelenting assault being brought to Cactus Jack. Just like we talked about, keeping the hits coming. Cactus just getting it taken to him again and again. <laughs> That's gonna sting. And a reversal by Gr Here we go. It's popping off. Ooh. Nothing pretty here, just good old-fashioned fisticuffs. So much pride, so much resiliency on display. The willpower, the sheer guts of these two. That holds back Cactus Jack's attack. Who will break first? That is the question. Ooh. Ooh, ouch. He had it scouted. Let's your favorite, Corey. Brilliant. Championship dream has become reality. She is one of the best to ever do it in the women's division. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Denver, Colorado, E. Torres. Eve is a natural-born competitor who possesses crazy athleticism and an amazing in-ring IQ. Eve Torres is the real deal. Eve Torres, an expert at finding weakness and exploiting it. A woman who turned her back on the WWE Universe and never looked back. It was the best decision she ever made. Laying people out with a smile and a pose. Glamazon looks to be in a bad mood. It is safe to say that the Glamazon has inspired generations of superstars here in WWE. I think it's safe to say that Beth Phoenix is no longer interested in inspiring. She just wants to re-establish dominance. She's also got bigger biceps than you, Saxton. Oh, wait, I haven't mentioned mine lately. The youngest Hall of Fame inductee in the history of WWE. One of the standout superstars of WWE's Divas era, Eve, continues her path of dominance tonight. Eve has a versus Penny predicament, shoulders down, and she kicks out. She probably didn't expect it to put her away there, but she's put her on notice. What's coming next? Back suplex. Very nice. Nice somersault senton. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, jaw shattering. Uh oh, jaw breaker. Call the dentist. And Torres <laughs> has taken control. Right now, Eve is doing whatever she feels like doing. Eve going up. Up high. 
Uh-oh, got snatched up here. And the fighting back gets them out of a precarious position. She's forced onto the defensive now. Yeah, that's Eve putting her in-ring acumen to good use. During the Divas era, Eve proved herself to be a multi-talented competitor. Corey, what do you think she can do to prove she belongs in this modern version of the women's division? Well, for my money, it's the jiu-jitsu. Eve was one of the first women in WWE to truly incorporate mixed martial arts into her arsenal. If she leans on that ingenuity and stamina, I think she'll fit right in. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. And a big oh. Can she do it here? Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? Got to change something up with the pin technique. Oh, what a clothesline! Incredible reversal into a DDT. Block the effort and cut them off with a shot to the gut. Reciprocating the initial reversal. Getting carried, unsure what they're thinking. Right across the larynx. Taking their time. A oh, vertical suplex. Look at the power here. Absolutely incredible. Walking around the ring. It could change the course of the match. Launching. Oh, flattening the opposition. Oh, dear. Taking a page out of the Michael Cole playbook. Knew what was coming there. Oh, yeah. She is really getting fired up. Oh, there's a response against Eve. Look at this. Going counter for counter. Uh-oh. Oh, and Beth turns the tables. Put her in a position now. Ooh, that's just shot to the throat. The cover. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. Still in it. Hoist it up. Right to the gut. She's beginning to flag a little. Incoming! Big time power bomb! Now that's what you call impact! Solid contact from Beth Phoenix. She lets her free. But the damage was certainly done, Michael. The Glamazon giving these people a chance to appreciate what a dominant figure looks like. Was ready for that. Well executed takedown. Oh, no, oh, 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 shoulders down. And she fights it off. Obviously still has some fight left. Using the knee. Ooh, she hit the corner hard. Her opponent has her cornered now. I don't think she even knows where she is at this point. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Carefully measured knee drop. Right in the middle of the glass. Right in the face. My God. And Torres' 
is taking control. Yeah, Beth has run into a roadblock. And now gets tossed into the ring. Oh, man. Oh, stomping away. She's going for it. This could be. And a kick out at two. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Sit out, nasty. Oh, shot elbow. Oh, what a close line! Oh, I didn't go as planned there. Dominating shoulder tackle. Lining it up. Gonna cut him in half. Boom! Beth Phoenix showing just how much of a human wrecking ball she really... The power of the Glamazon. Beth Phoenix with a glam slam. Perhaps thinking something else here. Not sure why, though, Michael. She seemed to have it really cinched in. She's going up. Top rope here. From the top. Man, by the hair. Hair whip. Rolling neck snap. Counters. These two trading counters, an absolute master class. Eve Torres setting her up. Glancy. Oh, dear. There's a heartbreaker. Torres. Has her staring at the lights. Two count, near five. Her perseverance is unreal. Preserving her opportunity to keep this match alive. The heaviest artillery has been used, but it's not enough for the three. You can just see how much winning this match means to these women. They are absolutely going above and beyond to put each other away. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Cut off with a kick to the gut. Counter after counter. Boom at the button. Placed into the corner. Just around like a rag doll. For the win. And a victory here tonight. Here is your winner. The Glamazon. losing side of things tonight. The Glamazon is the last one standing, once again proving that no opponent is too big or too... Behold the Ravishing One. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Robbinsdale, Minnesota, Weighing in at 240 pounds, Ravishing Rick Rude. Appearances can be deceiving, but do not be fooled. Despite the Ravishing One's looks, this is a tough human being. I, for one, am just excited that Rude made it into the arena safely. There was a line of women outside four blocks long waiting to get their hands on the Ravishing One. He wouldn't even give me an autograph when I asked.
Intensity, integrity, intelligence. Kurt Angle definitely practices what he preaches when he steps into the ring. Yeah, Michael, and sometimes we've seen him take that intensity a bit too far. We've not only seen how far Angle has pushed his opponents, but also how far he's willing to push himself. That is definitely something to keep an eye on with Kurt tonight, Byron. But Rick Rude has a habit of backing up all the trash talk he spews before a match. And believe me, he spewed a lot of trash talk before this match. Rude's body isn't just for show, it's also for function. And that function is dismantling his opponents any way he sees fit. Nice, nice takedown. Oh, did you hear that? What are they doing here? And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. That arm's gonna be sore for a while. Could affect all their offense. He's taking this to the floor now. The flip DDT! And that's gonna leave a mark on Rick. Yeah, that's an example of Angle taking it that extra mile. For a good punch. measure. He saw that one coming. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. And he's able to reverse. The sequence of reversals there. Getting carried a lot of bad spot to be in. Driven down face first. And he cuts bait, slipping out of the ring. Shut up, Saxton. This is just a small... Oh, it's soon. We could be... Sa he needs to find an escape prop. Nice. <laughs> Oof. Point of the elbow counters that. Corey, it has to be hard for anyone to enter a match against Kurt Angle, knowing what he's capable of. Look, we know Kurt Angle's a world-class athlete, but he's also a world-class hothead. We've seen how that quickness to anger can backfire on Angle. So if you can frustrate him, he'll lose his quick... He could pin his opponent right here! Gets his shoulder up before the two count. It's not over yet. Plenty left to go in this one. So much damage inflicted. Big counter by Angle. Kurt Angle. Kurt Angle with the angle slam. Off into the pin. There's two. Breaks the close count. Good Lord. Scarily close to three. <laughs> angle with a spectacular single leg into the ankle lock. This does not look good. Angle may have it. I'm not quite sure if this man shouldn't tap out. Look at this. He let it go. Curious decision there, Michael. Counter! And now there's an opening. A counter answered by another counter. And responds with a counter of their own. Reversal on Rude. Angle heads up. From the top. Oh, straight to the floor. Taken to the air and completely wiping out. Taken down with a chop block. Got it scouted. Tossed back into the ring. Angle playing to the crowd. Let's see if they tell him he sucks. This match is brutality starting to show on him. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. Rude getting the crowd involved. Maybe that will shut him up. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, wow. Enough already. <laughs> 
And it looks like that one opened a pretty good gash on Rick. And look at front big back suplex. Oh, I rake. That's not right, but effective. Face first with a waist lock takedown. And Rude is being aligned into position. Backfire into a DDT. Rick Rude going for it. Oh, simply ravishing a Rude Awakening. Did Rick just put an end to this? What in the world? There's your intensity on display from Angle. And I think to get the pinfall, you have to try that maneuver one more time. Angle gets the better there. What a punch. Turning the tables. Reversal on top going head to head, putting each other to the test. It looks like we've got ourselves a brawl here. Neither competitor is backing down. Boom. This is a war of attrition with neither superstar wanting to be the one who surrenders. And another counter. Ooh. WWE Universe appreciating these athletes going all out. Close line. Ankle lock applied. The submission is cinched in. It could be over. That's it. Kurt Angle gets it done. Here is your winner, Kurt Angle. A disappointing showing for Rick Rude, ending in defeat. The Olympic gold medalist doing what he does best, gentlemen, winning. The third man has arrived. The undisputed leader of the New World Order. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the NWO from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 302 pounds, the World Heavyweight Champion, Hollywood. This man changed sports entertainment history on July 7th, 1996. Oh, that night broke my heart. Hulk Hogan turned his back on WCW, his Hulkamaniacs, and all of his allies to form the New World Order. No longer about saying your prayers and taking your vitamins, Byron. I guess if you ask Hollywood Hogan, the reality is that those will only take you so far. Now Hogan feels like he needs to bend the rules to get ahead. No, 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 no. Hogan is simply no longer bound by the rules, Saxton. Hulk Hogan cannot be stopped. Unmatched success in sports entertainment. Unmatched box office power and unmatched physique. Cole, what you gonna do when Hollywood runs wild on you? Charismatic, 
Superstar Billy Graham is a true pioneer of sports entertainment. You're right, Cole. This is a man who deserves an entire wing of the WWE Hall of Fame. With a real superstar in the building, we are about to see something special. Many Hall of Famers pattern themselves after Graham, and we're all about to see exactly why. The plague of sports entertainment, Hollywood Hulk Hogan might be one of the most detested superstars to ever enter the ring. Love him or hate him, Cole, there is no denying that Hollywood Hogan is a monumental opponent for any athlete. If he can overcome his power, you then have to watch out for his underhanded tactics, a formidable opponent indeed. And on the other side of the ring is the reflection of perfection. Superstar Billy Graham's going to flex his pythons and crush his foe like an industrial compactor. Graham's physique is sculpted from granite and practically acts as body armor from an opponent's attack. A flat out power into the scoop slam. Oh, the elbow connects. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Check your face out of that one. Hogan winning that exchange. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. Oh, and a reversal. Oh, what a close line. position here. Oh, 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 just bounce that face like a basketball. Earth-shaking power slam. Right in the mouth. Oh, relentless. Right in the face. Wait, 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 wait. And he easily kicks out of the count. I didn't think this match was close to over. Oh. Knee to the face. Oh, just gouging the face. A ripping and tearing at the face. All's fair in love and war, gentlemen. I saw nothing but effective offense. And Hogan is firmly in command. Going to be hard to stop the Hulkster here. Facing off against Hollywood Hulk Hogan has got to be a mental and physical hurdle. Corey, how do you prepare to take on someone like Hogan? Quite simply, there's no telling what Hollywood's going to do. To beat him, you can't be afraid to get on his level. You can't be afraid to bend the rules and stoop to the same tricks he would. Setting up. Nice suplex. Measuring. Oh, face stop. What the leg? Look at this. He just tossed the leg. Just got thrown around like a sack of you know what. Okay, he is not going to let him make a mockery of things. Scooped up, tilt the wall slam. Oh, look at his aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. He's struggling a bit here. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Oh! Loving blow. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Hits him with the counter. Boom! What a right! Ooh, merciless looking blow. In full control here. Face first in the turnbuckle. foot is a weapon so ruthless he can end it here oh he kicked out that was a long two count there 
Hollywood Hogan looking for the finishing touch. Uh oh. And Hogan gets stonewalled. This has got to be one of the most knocked out, drag out progressions of the robbery we've ever witnessed. Yeah, Byron, it's hard to recall the last time we saw something. Oh, no, he could be caught here. Bad spot for him. He's got it. Hardy gets out. Perhaps some renewed life in him now. Oh. Strong punch to the midsection. Oh, the point of the elbow finds the mark. Oh, it is aggression, just pure brutality. Come on, easy. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Soaring. What? Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Throw him back in under the ropes. Oh, God. Oh, sharp knee. Uh-oh. Carefully measured. Big leg drop. Graham now losing ground. Billy needs to bring the match back to his pace. Uh-oh. Face full of turnbuckle. And it's Hogan on the wrong end of more offense. Here's where Hogan has to hulk up and push through the paint. Utilizing the top rope to inflict more punishment. Across the top rope. He got whipped into that corner. Close line in the corner. Into the cover. Yeah, no. He doesn't get the three. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Oh, wow. Sharp jab. Series of strikes to the back. Loving blows. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Headed to the top rope. Up high. Some shock in the arena after that kick out. Measuring. Oh, face stop. An unyielding Billy Graham on the attack. Brutal attack showing he's not afraid to get on Hollywood's level. Hogan doesn't expect anyone to go where he goes. Superstar Billy Graham cinching in the bear hug. A bear hug by superstar Billy Graham. Uh, Matchup's over. That was a very competitive match here tonight. Now this man can... Oh, my God! The oh. Undertaker! Behind you! Oh, massive choke slam! The Reaper has arrived! What a scene!